Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a back to school makeup look and if you want to see how I do this simple and easy fast makeup look then keep on watching. So first I just like to put a headband in my hair just to get my hair all out of my face so I can do my makeup. And then I will take my witch hazel with a cotton round and clean my face before I put my primer on and today I'm using the NYX Hydro Touch Primer. I, like, I really like this primer. It smells really good too. <laughs> and then I take my CoverGirl Ready Set Gorgeous Concealer and just put it under my eyes for my dark circles and I will also be highlighting with this too. Then I will take my Real Techniques Miracle Complexion Sponge and just pat in all that concealer and you want to make sure that your sponge is damp to make it glide on better and so it won't be cakey or patchy. Then I will take my Maybelline Master Concealer and just put this on any imperfections that I have on my face and take my sponge just to pat that all in. Next I will take my Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless Pressed Powder. The first one is in 100 translucent and I am taking the sponge that comes with the makeup and just patting that all over my eyes to set the concealer and I will be baking for just a little bit. I'm then just taking my powder in 110 porcelain and setting that on my smile lines and any other areas that I put concealer on. I then take my big CoverGirl powder brush and take that same 110 powder and just pat that all over my face to even everything out and cover any areas that I didn't cover already. And then I will also take that down on my neck to blend that all in. Now I'm taking my e.l.f. complexion brush and just buffing and blending all the powder that we just patted on. I have my Eco Tools taper brush and I'm taking this with my Maybelline Fit Me Matted Poreless powder again and this time it's in 222. I am just patting this all over the outsides of my face to give my face some color and warm it all up. And now I'm just blending it all in. I then bring this down on my neck to match the color on my face and then put on my jawline to give my jaw a little more depth. And then I'll be taking my CoverGirl brush again just to blend that all out. Now I'm taking my NYC Bronzing Face Powder in Sunny and just putting that again on the outsides of my face to deepen my face just a little more and then taking it on my nose to give my nose that sunkissed look. 
And then I take my Milani Baked Blush in Luminoso, and I really like this blush because it highlights your cheeks without highlighter. And then I have my Sonia Kashuk 123 brush, and I will just sweep that all over my cheeks and on the apples of my cheeks too. And now so I don't look like a clown, I just take a brush and take all the excess powder off to smooth out my cheeks. And then I use my Mary Luminizer by The Balm to highlight the tip of my nose and the bridge uh, with my pinky finger. And then I will use a e.l.f. blush brush to highlight the tops of my cheeks. I will also just put this on my cupid's bow. Then I just take any makeup wipes that I have at the moment and just fold it up and take the corner of it and just clean off any excess powder that got on my eyebrows or just anything that got in there and just clean it all out. Then I take my Sonia Kashuk 126 brush and sweep that through my eyebrows to brush them through before I put my Maybelline Great Lash Clear Mascara on them. It's time for my Tarte Palette in Bloom, and I'm taking the color Smarty Pants with a e.l.f. blending brush and just patting that all over my eyelids. I then packed the shade Jet Setter on my outer V. Then I'll take the shade Charmer with a $1 outbrush brush and just pack that on my eyebrow bone to give it highlight. Now I'm taking Mary Luminizer once again and with my e.l.f. blending brush, just highlighting the inner corners of my eyes and then again on my eyebrow bones. Then I'm just taking Jet Setter and putting that on my lower lash line in the outside corner. And I also blend in Smarty Pants with that and then sweep off any excess powder that's on my face. Now it's time for eyeliner! I'm taking Physicians Formula Eye Booster Eyeliner in Ultra Black and I just lined that and then my Revlon Volume Length Magnified Mascara and I put that on my eyelashes. And last but not least, I have my L'Oreal Pro Matte Gloss in Bare Traction, and I will just gloss my lips up. You'll want to also use a setting spray just so your makeup stays in place. So this is the final look of my back to school makeup look. So thank you guys for watching. I hope to everyone that's going back to school has an amazing, wonderful year that's filled with joy and happiness and just great memories. And thank you guys again and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!